The Florida insurance industry is in turmoil, and that's meant a dramatic premium increase for homeowners here. The office that oversees the industry gave us an update today. Washington to Scott Heidler explains where we are in the efforts to reform the industry. The Central Florida real estate market has been on a steady upward trend for the past year. Unfortunately, the price of insuring those properties has also skyrocketed. Many insurance companies are going out of business and some homeowners are getting cancellation notices without ever filing a claim. The Senate passed legislation reducing roof claims and litigation, seeing as driving forces behind the increase in rates. So we moved from issue to issue, and the one consistent theme in all of those issues is an excessive amount of litigation. The office overseeing the Florida insurance industry gave the state cabinet an update Tuesday. The reforms that we're talking about, the reforms we've enacted in City Bill 76 and House Bill 7065, I think those are ultimately going to be effective in lowering costs for consumers. But none of this happens overnight, unfortunately. I wish that it would. The governor Tuesday saying more needs to be done. How Florida had 8% of the claims nationwide and over 75% of the litigation. Clearly, you know, there's some dysfunction in this. SB 76 did do some good things, but that was a compromise, um, and I don't think it did quite enough. The governor added that he's confident tougher legislation will go through later this year. Scott Heidler, West 2 News.